Good day, guys. Merry Meet. My name is Glennis. I'm the Witch of Whitetail Hollow. Thank you for joining me. If you're new, well, welcome. It is so, so nice to have you. I ho hope you hit the subscribe button and join us. And if you're returning, well, thank you so much for joining me again. Uh, gosh, you know, it looks like I've been, and you're only seeing a very, very small portion of <laughs> what's been going on here, but I have been just right in my element this morning. I've actually been fulfilling some orders here, and I've been working, and I want to... Now, you guys already know the gist of my protection balls, and what I thought I would do, you know, and, and they said, well, I really want it for my car, so don't seal it up, and I totally understand that, um, because, I mean, cars are getting hot. <laughs> so what I thought I would do and what I did was I mixed everything that I gathered together, actually in this little small tray right here, and I worked with it and worked with it, and I thought, well, you know, I'm since I'm taking everything up a notch, I may as well just kind of just go all out. I mean, I just love doing this, and I love doing it because, of course, I love you guys, but I also love it because it works. I mean, plain and simple. You're going to be protected and you're going to be guarded and there may be even a few other surprises you don't know that's going to come your way. All of it's good. All of it's good. But um, I'm going to be able to get these packages out. I thought I was going to get them out today and then I thought, you know, what I really want to do is I really want to charge them on my altar. I want to work with them today. I've got a rune here. I think you guys can see it. Yes, right there. That I'm I'm going to be charging it with. And this room is a haz. And it's this rune is designed to remind you of your responsibilities in your car, in your home with your family or whatever, but this is strictly a protection room just for you. And which is why it's it's shaped this way. It draws all of the energy into you. And so that's what I'm working with today. Um, but like I said, what I did is I gathered all my herbs together and I charged them and I was working with them. And what I did I decided not only can I put this in here, I mean, if you want to hang this in your home, of course you can. That's, you know, or in your bedroom or, you know, whatever. You can take it in your car because, again, if you want to add or take something or if you want to add some more essential oils to it, I'll tell you which essential oils I use too, but um, then this will pop right off and pop right back on. But what I did is I didn't put the essential oils in here because I didn't want the balls to get mucked up. But I did, once I had the balls filled, I made some bags up. And again, you can, you can use this in a, a dresser drawer. You can put this under the seat of your car. You could actually, for the five minutes or whatever that you want to warm your car up or you get ready, geared up to go, just leave it out in your car in the console, just pick it up and hold it for just a few moments and ask, you know, give me guidance, keep me calm, keep me safe. And then I said, well, why? And, and this, this is infused with essential oil, so this will smell just gorgeous. And I wish you guys were here now and smelling this. It, it is fabulous. And I said, well, why stop there? <laughs> so I took some little tea lights and again, I, I charged them and I infused them with a couple of different essential oils. I didn't want to add too many. Um, and again, with the herbs that I used here, I've placed in these little tea lights. And of course, anyone using little tea lights, you know, you should be very well aware of fire and things like that. But so these are charged as well for protection, patience, whatever it is that you think you need. So I've got this package here to go, 
And then I have this package here to go. And I, actually, I'm adding more to it, but I have some protection balls for them and some tea lights and a Hecate, Hecate candle for November for them. If they want to start, uh, I know they make regular offerings to Hecate or Hecate, however you want to pronounce it. Um, and I've been working with these candles, and so I, I so, so hope that they enjoy this candle. And again, they can, they can start burning it as they make offerings, or if they want to wait until November, whatever it is that they want to do. Um, but I, I mean, I added the normal, regular, everyday things that I always add to my protection balls, which, uh, you know, is rose, lavender, chamomile, and that's for love, calm, happiness. Uh, but I, I kind of geared this towards travel as well, since I know some of you are going to be traveling this long holiday weekend. Uh, I put a few extra things in here, and I'll tell you about those. Now, I also added licorice root, too, to, uh, for love, comfort, health, happiness. But I added star anise and anise seeds, and this is to ensure no bad dreams, and it drives away evil. So you may want to put this under a child's bed or in a child's room, something like that if you want to. And I've also added calamus root, and I, I honestly, I keep calamus root in the corners of my kitchen, and they guard against hunger and poverty. And they also, and also using calamus root makes spells stronger, and it binds the spell as well. It makes it spells very, very strong. And I added allspice, and allspice attracts money and luck. So not only are, is this for protection, love, uh, to keep you safe, healthy, happy, uh, it's for prosperity as well. Um, Let's see, and I've added citrine to these balls for prosperity. I've added moss for a binding agent. If anything does come towards you with ill intent, moss is a protective to bind. And did you know that, I believe in Ireland and Scotland, of course you guys know I'm Scottish, but... Uh, Moss is typically placed beneath rugs so that there is a flow of money, a, a steady flow of money into the home. So I used moss in here, and I used juniper berries, and they guard against theft. And so, well, you know, what can I say? Your car is sitting there all by its lonesome. You know, sometimes, well, people do have ill intent. So juniper berries guard against theft, and I also added elderberries. They are for protection, prosperity, and healing. And I did add sage, and I'm gonna reach down here really quickly. I did add sage, of course, and I wanna thank a very, very special person who gifted me this sage. Holy smokes, am I ever just the luckiest girl ever. Thank you so, so much. But, um, of course, I added sage, and, you know, just for a double whammy of protection, just to guard against who knows what, I did uh, put some holy wood chips in absolutely everything. Um, I added some sassafras, and it is used to increase wealth, good luck, in money and business. Uh, and again, rose petals, chamomile, bay leaves, rue. I mean, you know all of those Those things are for protection. But the essential oils I added, and again, I'm just kind of reinforcing what I've already added that is dry. And I've added lavender. I've added sage. I've added hyssop. Oops, excuse me. Cedar wood. And I, do, I did add... Uh, juniper and cedar in here, and rose, and rosemary. Uh, and I think that's 
probably about it. And of course I added my hibiscus, which is for love, and uh, some patchouli, and that's to attract money and love. And it is also used in protection workings. So you can go wrong with adding patchouli. But uh, I hope everyone has a wonderful, wonderful day. And thank you so much for joining me. And if anyone has any questions, then please feel free to ask. And with that, I will say Mary Part. And I so, so hope to Mary meet again. Goodbye, guys.